Hello friends. So I have uh, made some decisions on my burlap bag, my burlap tote. If you can see, I changed my mind about where I was going to put this lace originally. I told you I was thinking about putting it here. And I changed my mind and I've put it lower. And I actually used both this and them. I used them both. The the vintage um, lace or vintage doily which is just as the edge of a doily that I um, tea dyed and I also used the bottom of the now I can't make a decision I added the, this here and, and now I can't make a decision on whether to make it very blinky to <laughs> this one has a nice big bling on it I could actually use this flower and so this is what I do when I'm when I'm designing things I mess with it I put it there and then I make decisions um, or do I want to add a little color I wish that you were here with me to tell me I was actually thinking of adding the color and making the flower bigger but I'm going to be adding more to this project. At the bottom so, I added a piece of um, applique there and the flower is going to go right in the middle and I'm really leaning towards the giant bling right in the center and then embellishing a little bit more um, with some flowers and I'll probably will not do a lot of decorating on the back but I will carry something over um, let's see. See what I come up with. Um, you'll see the next step as um, I arrive at it. <laughs> Who knows what it's going to look like, but um, there you go. This is what I have so far. Hello, this is Liz with Crafty Devotion. It is time to show you the, some of my decisions that I made on my project. So as you can see, I did what I explained last time. But I added some more embellishments here where I had that strip of um, square pearls I added some lace added some pearls along here I already fixed affixed my flower that I chose I actually made it larger by adding a piece of beautiful lace behind it it's more like a, this is a, like a satiny lace. Let's see if you can see that. Satiny lace, and I have that beautiful bling. And I added some pearls here at the bottom. Now I will be next be working on the sides here. Let me show them to you. So, so far, this is what they look like. I kind of leave it long until I make a decision on what I'm going to be doing. I believe I will be um, attaching maybe some lace along here or I might actually put an entire fabric here. I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do, but um, on the back I still haven't added anything other than the this. So I'll probably add something from the other side that I bring it over to this side, but I will not do too much of an embellishment on it so it will be one side that will be lovely and this is a very large bag I do not think I told you what size it was let me show you the size this tote is it is almost 15 inches wide and it still has the the edges here which open up I'm sorry, I keep on moving my camera. Maybe I will be able to afford someday a better camera. Five inches along the edges here. And then let's see the length. The handles to the bottom, 16 inches to the edge of the square, about 14. There we go. So it's a very large bag. It is made for carrying items inside. It's a nice big tote. So, I'm almost done with it. 
let's see what I add next so I can share it with you. And make sure you comment below, ask any questions, and I'll try to answer them. Thank you.